Hi, it's Tiffany. Here's a quick demo on how You Can Book Me can help support your school scheduling needs, all to your student success. What is You Can Book Me? We're an online application that helps streamline scheduling for everyone at your school. You connect your calendar or your colleagues' calendars to a public-facing appointment page where you take bookings. It automatically syncs with the connected calendars, offering up only time where you or your colleagues are free to take meetings or calls with students. That means no more back and forth emails or phone calls to find a time to meet. What will you do with all that time you and your team save? As you're setting up, you'll find features like automated notifications to appointment types and group bookings and nearly unlimited customization to fit your school's look. Who uses You Can Book Me? Departments like financial aid, advising, recruitment, success to name a few. Some schools book musical auditions and office hours. You Can Book Me can fit into your everyday workflow. In this demo, we'll show you how to invite your department to join your account and how they'll accept the invitation. Then we'll show how each team member will connect their preferred calendar for bookings and their Zoom account if your school uses Zoom. Next, we'll talk about creating booking pages for your department using our Teams feature and how you can customize things like availability, appointment types, the booking form, and more. Then, we'll show you how to set up the confirmation emails that will automatically send out to the team member and the student when a booking is made. And finally, we'll show you how to create a booking page for an individual on your team and when you might choose to use this setup. Ready? Let's go! Navigating to the team management page from the top account menu, I'll send out invitations to my team to join my account by clicking invite team members. Team members marked pending have not yet accepted the invitation. Each team member you invite will receive an email asking them to join your account. If they don't have an account already, they'll be prompted to create one. In the sign up process, they will enter their name, password, and then select the calendar they want to use for bookings. Once each team member has successfully connected their calendar to You Can Book Me, they can click on integrations to add their individual Zoom account if they want to generate unique Zoom links for each booking. We can also generate Google Meet links, but no separate integration is necessary. When all of your team members have joined your account, you'll see that their role becomes adjustable on the team management page. There are three roles you can assign team members. Contributor is the most restricted access. When they log into their You Can Book Me account, they will only see what integrations they are sharing with you, their calendar account, their Zoom account, and so on. The editor role allows you to assign specific booking pages to a team member. When they log into their You Can Book Me account, they will see only those assigned booking pages on their dashboard, along with any bookings made on that page. They cannot create additional pages or delete the assigned booking page. The administrator role can see all of the booking pages on the account and can create new booking pages on behalf of the team. The administrator can also manage other users on the account, adjust roles, invite new team members, and remove team members. As the account owner, you have the same powers as the administrator and can also see the billing details on your account. If you invited someone to your account who already had an account and booking pages, you'll want to restore their access by making them an editor. Then click Manage Booking Page Access and assign booking pages back to them. Once this is done, they will see those booking pages on their own You Can Book Me dashboard when logged in. For our demo, I'm making the financial aid department head and administrator so they can invite additional people as their team grows, and they can also create and manage booking pages for their team. On your account dashboard, you can create up to 200 booking pages for your team. Start by clicking Create Booking Page. You can create a booking page for an individual team member or for an entire team or department. Let's look at a team booking page first. This is the booking page for the financial aid advising team. Everything on the booking page is customizable. The title of the booking page, the subdomain of the URL that you'll share with the students, and the logo for the page. Under Calendar and Teams, we will add all of the members of this department to the page. For each team member, you'll enter their name, the email address where they want to receive notice about bookings, 
and the calendar where they want to take bookings. Click the circle image icon to upload a headshot of the team member. Once all of the team members are connected to this booking page, you can decide to display no preference. That gives the students the option of viewing all of the team members availability pooled together, giving them the widest selection of booking times possible. If you don't want the students to select an advisor, then check assume no preference, which will skip the team selection page. That's the core functionality of this team booking page the ability to pool availability together and allow multiple people in the department to take bookings on the same booking link. If both Amy and Lisa on this team are available at the same time, they would both receive a booking in that slot. If Mike has a busy event on his calendar, that time would not be available for a student to book, but other advisors would be available for booking. The other core piece is availability. By default, we will check your team members' calendars during a set standard working schedule set under times and availability. Between these hours, You Can Book Me will pull in free time from all of the team members' calendars. Each team member can manage when they're available for booking by adding busy events on their calendar during the times they don't want to be booked. This standard way of setting availability allows the team to offer a large range of booking times to students. As long as the advisors are available on their calendar, students can book with them. It is also a good solution when all team members are in the same time zone, as the working hours set in You Can Book Me will apply to everyone on the team. If you want your team to have more control over the times offered to students for booking, you can use custom availability. This is more of a calendar managed availability where each person on the team indicates the hours they want to receive bookings by adding a key phrase to their calendar. In this demo, the key phrase is open for advising. So each advisor has added blocks to their calendar on the days and times where they want to take meetings with students. Only where these events are found on the calendar will be displayed for booking on the booking page. The cool thing about this feature is that the availability is managed directly on each team member's calendar. They can add or remove availability on the fly just by adjusting those events without ever having to log in to You Can Book Me. There may be different kinds of meetings a student can have with an advisor. Use appointment types on your booking page to define the different types of meetings and the duration of each. This will help the advisor block out sufficient time to be fully focused on that student. The length of time possible for each appointment type will depend on the grid display you've set under duration and display. The settings you create here will apply to all of the advisors on this page, so all of the advisors must be able to offer these appointments. If you do use appointment types, you'll want to modify the text in the Intro for Appointment Type selection box as that will be the first thing students see when visit your booking page. The booking form allows you to build out any questions you need to ask of your students before they confirm the appointment. This could be as simple as contact information, school ID number, or a multiple choice question on how they would prefer to meet, in person, by phone, or on a video call. We can use this information on the booking form later to customize the messaging that sends to students in the confirmation and reminder emails. Questions on the booking form can be marked as required and reordered in a way that makes sense for your team and for your students. In the notification section, you can configure email templates that will send out to each student after booking based on the information they've provided on the booking form. For example, in the confirmation email, it will pull in their first name and the day and time of their appointment. You can customize both the appearance and the content of the email to represent your school. And if the student should reply to the email, you can have it send from the team member who received the appointment so that the reply goes straight to their inbox. The email to the team member receiving bookings can also be customized with any additional information they need before the start of the appointment. By default, we set a reminder to the team member and to the student one hour before the start of booking. But you can create additional email reminders days, hours, or minutes before the appointment starts. Don't forget to include in these emails how the student will meet with you. SMS reminders can be sent as well if you're collecting a phone number on your booking form. 
Credits for these are purchased outside of your subscription. Follow-up emails can be configured to send after the appointment, send a thank you, ask for feedback, or ask for the student to schedule their next meeting. The calendar events section gives you control over how the booking will appear on each team member's calendar and on the student's calendar. If you're using our Google Meet or Zoom integration, you can set the location here and it will add the unique link to the calendar event. You can also customize the title of the event, including what type of appointment was booked so the team member can see what they have on their agenda at a glance. Under styles and appearance, you can select from six standard booking page colors or use your school's custom color code. In the footer, you can include any general contact information you'd like your student to see when they visit your booking page. So that's a detailed look at a team booking page, this financial aid advising one we see here on the dashboard. A team booking page is a good idea for teams where it doesn't matter who the student books with, but you may have cases where the advisors have students assigned to them throughout the semester. In that case, creating individual booking pages would be a good route. This gives each advisor a personalized link to include in their email signatures. As we saw on the team booking page, each individual team member can customize things like their availability, appointment types, the booking form, and any notifications. Once you've created the booking page on your team member's behalf, go to the team management page and assign it to your team member so they can continue customizing their own personal page. Once you have the booking page configured for your team, you can access the live booking page that you'll share with students by clicking the link on the dashboard or by clicking the live booking page in a particular booking page settings. You can also generate a QR code that can be shared on your office door so students can just scan and book a time that fits their schedule. So how much does this functionality cost? Our pricing is $10 per calendar per month. That typically works out to $10 per team member per month. We also offer discounts for 12-month and 24-month commitments. For universities and qualifying K-12 schools, we're happy to offer a 30% educator discount. Please get in touch with our sales team to see if you qualify. On the team of four we saw in this live demo, we're looking at a monthly investment of $28 a month. And that really is a small investment when you think about the time your team will save. We estimate each booking through You Can Book Me represents a time savings of 10 minutes. That time saved gives your department more time to spend on where they can make a difference, helping students. Ready to streamline scheduling for your school? Start a 14-day free trial with no commitment and see if You Can Book Me is the right solution for you.